Before watching the video, discover how thousands are losing pounds in a week with the smoothie diet, check below for more details. Now to the video. No sugar for 30 days weight loss challenge. How cutting out sugar to lose weight works. Many crave the late night ice cream snack before bed. Something that's very delicious to eat, but not good for you either. Too much added sugar leads to not only weight gain, but diabetes and heart disease. High amounts of sugar leads to elevated levels of visceral fat in the body. This is not just bad for your body appearance, but your overall health. Some of the other risks of high sugar foods include poor oral health and liver health. High blood sugar levels are the leading health risk associated with high levels of sugar. Here is your 30-day detox plan to eliminate sugar from your diet. Eating natural sources of sugar is okay, this means food sources like fruits. Any foods that have added sugar, you should avoid for this 30-day challenge. This requires inspecting every food you eat, because you'll find sugar is added almost to all food sources. Foods like pizza, crackers, tomato sauce, they almost always have added sugar in them. You may find just eating strictly organic for 30 days will work best for this challenge. Because almost all processed foods contain at least some sugar. Drinks are the biggest culprit, especially sweet teas, sodas, and fruit juices. You'll want to completely avoid any drink that has added calories, as chances are there's sugar in the drink. Best case would be just to stick to coffee, homemade green tea, and good old water as your choice of beverage. Also, stay away from any natural sweeteners and artificial sweeteners during this 30-day challenge. Artificial sweeteners are not good for you anyways, but the real reason is you don't want any desire to backslide. If you're eating for example honey, your brain will start to trigger a desire to eat that favorite sugary snack of yours. Because that sweet taste becomes hard to avoid old guilty pleasures. Make sure all desserts are also out of the house in this 30-day challenge. Because if any are in the house, you may find it very challenging to resist. Some of the things you should be eating in this 30-day challenge. For breakfast, eating eggs or non-fat plain yogurt with either blueberries or strawberries. You can also have grapefruit for breakfast, it's very healthy and quite filling too. Avoid oatmeals and cereals during this 30-day challenge. If you're a snack person, you can eat nuts, like almonds and cashews during this challenge. If you love having dessert, then this is really going to be the hardest part of the challenge. I find having organic peaches the best healthiest alternative to any dessert out there. If they're still in season, having peaches for dessert can really change your cravings. Also, it's very important to be eating a lot of good vegetables in this 30-day challenge. Here's how the 30-day sugar detox works for weight loss. Almost all bad food sources contain sugar in them. You're not just going to detox sugar out of your diet, but you're also going to improve your eating habits. 
This is something hopefully you can eventually start doing long term, to benefit not just a slimmer body, but an overall healthier lifestyle. Thanks for watching, please check the description box below.